Day or I just can't play. <laughs> oh, hello there. I'm feeling a little bit poorly. Oh. Will Mr. Bookaboo please come back to the stage? Bookaboo to the stage. No, I won't. <clears throat> I've got bookalacolitis. If I don't share a story soon, then I can't go back on stage. <laughs> the band have sent me back some presents. I've got some grapes here from Begsy. Got pips in them. They're a bit yuck. Uh, and then some really, really cool rock magazines from Paws, which is very thoughtful. <laughs> And I'm in all of them, which is nice. And then, of course, you've got this really, really cool scooter here from Growler. But I'm a bit poorly, so I can't go out in my scooter. I've just got to stay here in bed. Maybe read my Rolling Bone magazine. But it is a really cool scooter. But I've got to stay in bed. Yeah. But I bet it goes really, really fast. But I've got to stay in bed. But it is really, really, really shiny. Oh, I can't take it anymore. It's no good. I've got to go out to my scooter. <laughs> <laughs> Away. I'm not coming out. Hi, Bookaboo. You in there? You okay? It's the amazing athlete and Olympic gold medal winner, Dame Kelly Holmes. She's a really fast runner. Hello, really fast runner, Dame Kelly Holmes. Bookaboo, how comes you're not on stage? Come on! You've got to be in it to win it. I don't really feel like a winner. Sounds like you need to believe it to achieve it. But I don't believe it. Just try, Bookaboo. Say after me. I can be on stage. I can be on stage. I can play the drums. I can play the drums. I can be the best rock puppy drummer in the world. I can be the best rock puppy drummer in the world. Better? No. Well, I, uh, I do feel better, but I'm just still not quite there. Ah, you're talking about a bit of inspiration, aren't you? What's your inspiration, Dame Kelly Holmes? What makes you want to be the best? Medals, big shiny ones, gold ones. How about you? Shall I tell her? She does seem to really want to help. Right. A story. Simple as that. I just need someone to tell me a story. What, you want me to read you a story? Please. Oh, well, you're definitely a winner then, because look what I've got here. Book <laughs> book. She's got the book about. Come on in, really fast runner, Dame Kelly Holmes. <laughs> Sorry about that, Dame Kelly Holmes. <laughs> You've got the book a bag? Uh, we've got a bag. You want to see what's in it? Please, please. You want to see? Yes, yes. Okay, shall we have a look? Here we go. <gasps> oh, what an enormous nose. Hey, what do you mean? Oh, no. I've gone and told Dame Kelly Holmes she's got an enormous nose. Um, uh, what a big mistake. Big mistake? Uh, yeah, what just you, a big what, mistake. What do you mean? I, yeah, I'm not talking about you. I'm talking about the front of the book. Big, enormous uh, nose. Norma Snows by Paula Metcalf. I'll let you off then. Phew. Nice pictures. They are, aren't they? Mm. Okay, so, 
Mr. and Mrs. Snows look proudly at their beautiful brand new daughter. A baby? Oh. Let's call her Norma, said Mrs. Snows. Norma Snows suits her perfectly, said Mrs. Snows. It certainly suits her enormous nose. <laughs> at the local parent and toddler group, Mrs. Snows was the envy of all the other mums and dads. What they would have given for a hands-free baby... Oh, look! She's hanging by her enormous nose. <laughs> she is. Look, that's really helpful, isn't it? <laughs> Norma was the first baby to learn how to crawl. Mrs. Snows was very proud. Clever, Norma. As she got older, Norma became a very helpful girl. <laughs> she helped with the shopping. Very helpful. She helped with the laundry. Very, very helpful. And she helped keep Dad out of Mum's hair. <laughs> very clever, Norma. When she started school, it became clear that Norma was not only helpful, but talented too. Music lessons were a favourite. Has she got an enormous nose stuck in the piano? <laughs> she was brilliant at gymnastics. <laughs> Impressive! And on sports day, Norma won the running. Gold medal Norma. Hopping. Gold medal Norma. And skipping. Triple gold medal Norma. <laughs> By a nose. By a nose. Imagine that. Winning by a nose. I know, well, I did. You did? Yeah, that's how I won my gold medals. You won it by a nose? I did, just like a little, tiny little bit. Tiny little bit. So have you got your nose to thank for that gold medal? <laughs> <laughs> One morning, Norma was practicing her hula hooping skills in the playground. Oh, wow. She certainly has some hula hooping skills, doesn't she? Is there no end to your talent? Asked her teacher. I don't think so. Replied Norma. But then she started to worry. What if she did run out of talents? Oh dear, I sometimes wonder that. If I'll ever run out of talents, do you? Well, I just always want to try and be the best I can be. That's why you want so many medals. <laughs> Later on, Norma's class were learning about aeroplanes. But Norma wasn't listening. She was too busy thinking. What was she thinking, Dame Kelly? There must be another talent I haven't discovered yet. I wonder what it is. I don't know. I wonder what it is. Aeroplanes have long noses, which help them to glide through the sky, the teacher was saying. Mm. Suddenly, Norma's ears pricked up. <gasps> Just like me, she thought. That lunchtime, Norma wrote an exciting message on the board. She's been inspired. Meet on the field after school and see my brand new talent. A world first. World first? When lessons had finished, Norma led everyone out to the field. Please keep off the runway, shouted Norma. Runway? Whoops, I mean run up. Eyes set on the sky, Norma started to run. Faster and faster <laughs> as she raced down the field. <laughs> and finally, with a huge leap, <laughs> She took off. Oh, wow. Up, up she went. And then... Keep watch. Suddenly everything went black. All black. <gasps> oh. What's happened? Is she all right? Is she? But when Norma opened her eyes, the world looked very different. Oh, dear, gasped the teacher. It's all upside down. Are you OK? For a few moments, Norma stared at her audience in silence. Then very slowly, a big upside-down smile spread across her face. Of course I'm OK! Phew! That went perfectly! Behold, the world's first ever... What? No-handed handstands! <laughs> She's landed on her nose! <laughs> Her enormous nose. <laughs> Norma breathed a sigh of relief. <sighs> it seemed there was no end to her talents after all. The talented Norma Snows. Well, thanks for reading <laughs> me this lovely story, Kelly. Did you enjoy it? Yeah, I did. I really like that. It's really got me inspired. Does it? Oh, yeah. Oh, oh really? Yeah. What's that mean? No. No. Oh, oh, are you ready?
share the book today.